Get right to it today. Some breaking news we're following out of Blair County at this hour. A suspect charged for her connection in the murder of a young mother has pled guilty. The Altoona woman, Catherine Copley, was murdered by her husband, Michael, back in 2015. Her body was found about six months later in a garage behind a vacant house in Altoona. Police say their investigation showed that Samantha Musselman helped Copley hide the body. That was Mr. Copley hide the body and agreed with him in front of witnesses that the body of Catherine Copley would not be found. I want to get you out live to our Colleen Knudsen right now. She's at the courthouse for us this afternoon where Musselman's hearing wrapped up a short time ago. Colleen, good afternoon to you. Casey, good afternoon. It was an emotional a day in court today for the family of Catherine Copley. Samantha Musselman entered a guilty plea to criminal conspiracy to engage in the abuse of a corpse. When asked by District Attorney Pete Weeks, she admitted she conspired with Michael Copley, Kathy Copley's husband. She also admitted that either she or Copley, quote, went a step further and completed that conspiracy. The maximum sentence for this charge, which is a misdemeanor too, is 24 months. Musselman was sentenced to 12 to 24 months in jail, but she received credit for the 17 months she's already served in Blair County Prison. And because of that, she will be given parole and possibly released later this afternoon. Now, I spoke with the family after the hearing, and they say that they were frustrated because Musselman and her attorney were not in the courtroom physically. They video conferenced in because of the COVID emergency. The family says they wanted her to be there in person and see her face when they read their impact statements. And they say today they did not receive justice. And as for Michael Copley, he is still awaiting his jury trial, which again had to be rescheduled because of the COVID pandemic. Casey. Major de developments today. Uh, Colleen uh, Knudsen live for us outside the Blair County Courthouse today. Colleen, thank you for that. Please and clear.